Um, actually, for me, it's like a personal stuff because my brother was kidnapped on the road and then we, we since then, we used the train since it was the safest. But now that the train has stopped, we have hardly traveled since like almost more than four months now. We have hardly traveled and it's serious. And if I should go now to see my family at Lagos, it will cost me nothing less than 100 to 150, 2000. So it's not good. It's affecting the masses seriously. Whether by road, whether by air, whether by train, nowhere is safe. But the truth is, we just need the government to intervene in every aspect in order to make things easy for the masses. Because transportation in this nation right now, as I said earlier, nowhere is safe. The insecurity in this nation, the government have failed us. So all we just need to just pray so that the government will intervene in all those ramifications so that things will get more better. It's, it's, it's a very bad stuff. It's not really good. Train is not working. And, and the plane is very, very expensive. Not everyone can afford it. And traveling by road is very, very risky because of the insecurity in Nigeria now. The government should just try and sort it out to make it easy for the safety of their citizens. The kidnapping on the road has made many low-income earners like me to opt in for transportation by train. But since the train services has been stopped from Kano to Lagos, we have to go back to the road because we cannot afford air tickets. Traveling by road is very dangerous, but we have no other option. Still, it's very, very bad. You know, train is somehow safe before. But as you can see, it's no more safe. And the life is very difficult. Transportation is very difficult. Everything is very high. So, I don't know. We are calling on the federal government to come and assist us. You know, let them come and fix things so that everything will be okay for us. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.